My name is Vikas Bairani and uh, I work as a principal data scientist and assistant vice president at Genpact and I lead the data science team there working on the machine learning and any kind of data analytics or predictive analytics engagement that we have with our clients. So I lead all those kind of projects, work with various different industries like CPG, healthcare, IoT, risk, banking and finance uh, and various different industries and we deliver the solutions for them uh, based you know, solving the problems using data science. So we see a lot of industries, uh, opportunities right now. Uh, you know, you see that insurance always looking out for any computer vision based solutions that how can they automate their claim processes. Also, we recently worked on a project with uh, Envision Version Racing where we did uh, some of the work where we uh, optimize their race strategy. It's a very different use case where actually uh, we help the drivers that how to win the races using data science. So you can see those kind of parallels between various different industries like healthcare, uh, where people always want to uh, do various different kind of uh, optimizations using data science. You know that those kind of parallels are very difficult to find, where you can actually uh, you know strategizing the race, and then various different industries like finance, uh, where they want to optimize their working capital. How do you draw parallel with those? So we are helping the drawing those parallels between our experience in this uh, version racing that we did uh, recently. So these, these days, I think the challenge is the biggest challenge that we see is that how do you secure your data and then deliver the solution at the same time? Because for data scientists, uh, they need to generate, you know, use the data to make the solutions. At the same time, the organizations are required to, you know, based on the regulatory requirements, they have to protect their data. So how do you create a trade-off between providing data scientists with the data they need to build the models and deliver the value? So that's the challenge, you know, the trade-off that always goes on on a daily basis that we see. So organizations are copying up the skill gaps these days because uh, the universities are offering a lot of courses. At the same time, or organization like us, uh, we are actually uh, picking up the programs within Genpack to upskill our employees, existing employees, uh, to learn the machine learning, data science, Python coding, and various different programming. So we have a program called Genome, uh, which is helping our employees upskill you know, their hard skills as well as their soft skills. So they are learning programs, uh, programming languages uh, through the master gurus and the gurus within the organization who are actually experts in these areas. So they also at the same time learn the domain about if you are if you want to learn about the finance and accounting, there are master gurus available who can help you with that. So Genome is an excellent example of how organization can actually use to upskill their own employees. So we have a roadmap uh, and you see that you know, we, we kind of have a roadmap that we, we want to see the build-in uh, applications and the data science platforms uh, which can be accessible for everyone not just data scientists or a technical people that you know kind of helping everyone to learn, you know build the value out of their data without even knowing the programming that kind of roadmap i see will be very valuable for everyone this kind of events are an excellent opportunities for not just data scientists and the data practitioners or analytics practitioners to come together at the same time this is a good opportunity also for the uh, businessmen, business people or CXO levels to come and see what is going on uh, on a daily basis in data science world and the machine learning world. And they can actually take those learnings from here and actually implement into their own businesses and uh, drive the value out of it. Because you see that you have the speakers coming from various different backgrounds, you have tech talks going on that you can actually go and do a deep dive into the programming and the cores of the algorithms. Uh, which is an absolute, absolutely an amazing opportunity for everyone to learn.